welcome to Redneck Off The Range. Today, I'm gonna start the day off by going on a quick video shoot. So the shoot that I'm going on <clears throat> is uh, at this tree on campus called the Shoe Tree. Basically, it's a uh, Murray State tradition that uh, two people who attended Murray State end up getting married, they uh, put their shoes on the Shoe Tree. Um, so the whole idea behind this is last year uh, on the live show that we do uh, in a different class, this uh, guy and girl, a couple, I would do air quotes, but my hands are tied, um, they uh, got fake married on live TV, and it was kind of like this big, uh, big deal that kind of, it, it was multiple episodes of the show, like they did like, I don't know, five or six different episodes of like prepping for this wedding on live TV and uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to bring them back for like an interview and a newlywed game type thing and uh, this is just kind of some b-roll footage to kind of play in the background of the interview so yeah so this is what the shoe tree looks like and uh, basically what we're going to do is we're going to nail a couple of shoes to the tree or tie a couple of shoes to the tree and uh, just get a few different shots of that. Um, I'm set up over here. I mean, I'm probably going to move once they get here, but basically just waiting on them to get here. They've got about, I don't know, 10 minutes before they're really supposed to be here, so. And here comes one of the happy couple now. And here comes the bride. footage, got it dumped, edited it, got a little bit of an issue with uh, lack of audio during most of it, so I'm just going to probably edit in some background audio, um, but it's okay because it's just a background clip anyway. So on to the mess hall. I feel like a kid again eating chicken nuggets. Okay guys, so I mentioned that I uh, screwed up on the audio uh, yesterday, so what I did was I actually went and either downloaded or recorded just a bunch of different uh, audio files and uh, put them in there. So basically what happened was, um, not sure how clear it's going to be on this camera, but all of these little audio tracks down here are green, which means they were either recorded or downloaded separately from the camera audio, which is right here. So this is the only camera audio clip I actually recorded. And so, let's just play that now. Okay, so that's actually what that sounds like now. Let's just go through and mute everything. That way you can tell like that. That's basically what it looked like yesterday and sounded like yesterday before I fixed the audio. So what I did to fix the audio was first I went and found, uh, I recorded a or uh, actually downloaded a couple different things. This down, the very first one is basically one long two minute track of just kind of ambient uh, street people noises. Okay, sorry, got interrupted there, but basically it's just a two minute uh, clip of just this kind of noise. So it sounds like people are passing by on the sidewalk. And I basically just cut it up into three different sections here. Uh, so that you can tell that it does cut between each uh, little clip. Okay, so now the second row down, these are bird chirps. The, this is a track called Sunny Day, and this is a, a cardinal singing, and then this is a little more of this same first track. So let's listen to what this sounds like. Now, the 
next one down, let's unmute this and just put it on solo. Because uh, I forget what this one is. This might be... Alright, so yeah. This is actually this uh, four, or the uh, third row down is actually him talking. It's basically just supposed to be a mumble. It doesn't actually line up right, but when you combine it with all the other sounds that I have down here, um, uh, you can't really tell that it's uh, different. Now, these next couple um, on the same row, these are where their shoes uh, hit the ground. So the first one is the flip-flop, and basically I just uh, took a boom mic, went out there, and recorded a flip-flop uh, falling against the bark of the tree. So that, and I, you just make sure it, that the waveform lines up with where it happens uh, on the screen. And the next one, uh, I threw a shoe on the ground and recorded that with the same boom mic, and it sounds like this. So, let's uh, bring them all together. Go back to the beginning and just see what this sounds like. Okay, so then the only thing left was what's in the very last row here, which is basically her little laugh when she, uh, in this clip here, where she laughs or just kind of giggles, and then uh, at the very end, she, let's see, right here, she like, at the very end of the clip, she opens her mouth as if she's gonna say something. So basically what I did was I took a boom mic and recorded her uh, attempting to laugh because apparently laughing is like a very impossible task. So um, this is what the uh, final thing sounds like. And basically what I did was um, every time she moved her head on screen, I just basically changed to a different part of the laugh track. So she has her first kind of little giggle, she turns her head and she giggles a little more, and then she turns her head and laughs one last time. And then this uh, is the very end where she, it sounds like she's about to say something. I just took a little small clip of her saying like, uh, I can't do it or something. Uh, because she kept acting like she couldn't do it. And in the end, it sounds like a very natural scene. <laughs> and then this, obviously, is the actual natural sound. So, not too bad if I don't say so myself. Alright guys, back in my dorm room right now. Uh, after I did the uh, stuff with the audio on that uh, short video, um, I went back into my video package file and added the um, lower third graphics for my video package. Um, normally these are put in live uh, on the show, but I wanted to uh, have just the package to add to my uh, personal YouTube channel and uh, just to have in my in my video files. So I basically just edited the uh, little lower thirds in and uh, re-exported it and then I uh, uploaded it to YouTube. Um, so yeah, pretty quick and simple process. All you gotta do is just drag in the lower third and then type in the name and title of the uh, individual and uh, just make sure that all of the uh, position and uh, size settings are the same uh, for everything. Um, so, uh, yeah, pretty uh, quick and simple. So, anyway, that's really all the exciting stuff that I have for today. Um, so I'm just going to end the, the video here and just upload it to YouTube. So uh, subscribe to my channel, and uh, that was Redneck Off the Range. Until next time, be safe.